Quiet oh, yeah. negotiations, uh, quiet <laughs> um, talks have taken place for Anthony. Yeah, yeah. ridiculous. Yeah, that was so random, isn't it? I think he's, I'm um, saying that he's going to get a, a um, I think he's going to get a loan. I don't think we'll be able to sell him, but a loan might do him a world of good. Oh, KG. Yeah. Can, can, can I say? Can I say what we were talking about on the phone yesterday as well? Just again. Yeah, we were chatting on the phone. Like I brought this up on the morning show as well because yeah. can't stop talking about you. Um, and I we spoke about how. You were saying to me yesterday, despite you know what's going on with Amrabat and Amrabat yeah. at the moment, you're convinced that that front three for the FA Cup final is going to be Hoyland, Rashford, yes. Gunnacho. Doesn't matter what's going on at the moment. Absolutely, he's going to do it. He's not going to change his mind. Gunnacho has done a lot for him this season, and he's going to reward Gunnacho with a start. You can't leave out Rashford. You can't. You're asking unless, unless you're saying, "What's asking for war? You leaving out your main, your your main player in the in the FA Cup final?" He's playing. Your main play- what if your main players played bad all season? What this if is- the last time he played, okay. you know, part, a, a start? This is this is possible actually. If he doesn't start at Brighton and he yeah. starts at Wembley, then that'll be the last game he started was at Wembley in that what, shit show against Coventry. Guess what? Yeah, Wembley again, then, mate. Yeah. Guess what? There's a thing where there's there is a hierarchy system, and you um Flex was telling me about how the players see things, right? You're telling me I'm big Marcus Rashford, and in the like it's not why I, I don't agree with this, by the way. Mm. I'm Marcus Rashford, I'm on the I'm probably one of the senior players at the club, and you leave me out the FA Cup final against Man City. Yeah, yeah. Are, you what what are, are you what jobs on the line? What if your job's on the line? No, but I say, I'm saying it's war. If yeah, if you well, do, I'm saying if your job's on the line, who gives a shit about war? Oh, I, give, I care about myself. His job's on the line, though. That's the that's well, what maybe he should. Say. This is the thing, but I'm saying that how if if I'm trying to just look at it from a Marcus Rashford point of view and Camp Marcus Rashford, this that and the other, they'll probably be looking at it like no ways he dropped you, no ways he put you on the bench against City in the final. And now isn't that the problem dropped. though? Isn't that the problem with humility? Isn't that the problem then with Rashford himself? I'm too big to be dropped. No, you're not. What have well, you done? Every player's got what a problem with it. Every, exactly. No, I'm with you. I think, again, I would probably not play him, but I understand the nature of the beast in the sense of, end of the day, Garnacho is going to... I think the person that is going to be probably the victim is a potential Garnacho. It's Garnacho or Ahmed. He's going to go with Garnacho because he's put in... He's done a lot of running. He's done a lot of things that the manager likes. He's not going to risk this rivalry or this he's not going to risk it with Rashford especially when I need him to get right for next season but that's what I mean he's not going to be here though next season Rashford uh, listen Rashford is playing in the final absolutely he is he's playing in the final and you're right Owen you know the the way he's been playing he should get some serious sort of reprimand to say listen nah mate you've been way off it actually here's something you've never thought you'd experience yeah cup final at Wembley against our local our rivals yeah. Manchester Derby, you're not starting. And you've Huge been injured. message. Two and things. you've been injured. All of this stuff. But not going to happen. And to be fair, quite controversially, I know a lot of people disagreed with me. I, I think he should start. Rashford will score in that game. Well, I don't know if he'll score, but I'm, I'm saying, I just, I, well, I hope so. But I, I think he should start, though. I still think we have a better chance if he starts. I think Ganacho is running to the ground. I think he's knackered. I think against Walker, he'll get Nyam up like from early doors. I think he's a better... Imp- I think Marcus Rashford is redundant from the bench. Shouldn't be. You talk about mentality and all of that stuff, but bringing on Marcus Rashford in like the 70th minute, and some people may say, why do you even need to bring him on? Cool. No, yes, I think now. But I know, but some people... Listen, some people though are so like, Rashford's so done. Like, why? But, like, why does he, he have to play? play? Because yeah. he yeah. I'm not saying he has to play. Because big he goals. That's why. Like as in how he played against um was it how he played against Liverpool Liverpool was it yeah he's done the same thing as well he scored scored the goal against City he scored the one against Arsenal but at the same time you could say the same about Ahmad Ahmad scored a big goal against Liverpool Ahmad scored a big goal against Newcastle I'm not saying drop Ahmad by the way I'm saying Ahmad Garnacho scored big goals as well no but then he's gonna go with like he's more likely gonna in the FA Cup final you expect to see Rashford there I I don't. I don't disagree. My heart says that's what he will do. But my head says that, and we spoke about this this morning, Flex, didn't we? Saying about, like, it looks more likely that he's going to stay because the manual market. You know, like, guys, um, just literally on some, like, warmth and happiness, man. We are in the final. 
that's a good feeling. I know, like, it was embarrassing the way we got there, but there's nothing embarrassing about being there. You know, no, uh, no. it's going to be a great day out. The season finishes. You know that feeling of you watch finals, like we're going to watch the um, Champions League final. And there's that feeling of, oh, I wish we were there. You know, yeah, you want to be involved, like, didn't you? You want to be involved. Like every big club wants to be involved in these moments, except Spurs. No. Every big club wants to be in these moments, you know. So, like, this is it. This is what it's all about. So, come that day. to win, though, man. I just, up. you know what? I am going to, I'm not going to lie. I am, you're right. I'm going to get involved. I don't feel how I felt after the commentary one now. I'm, I'm over that. Like, like you said, it's cut final week, like, even though there's a game tomorrow. Uh, sorry, Saturday, Sunday. But, like, oh, I need it goes about saying energy, bro. I need that flex Liverpool energy, bro. Yeah, I need you. To yeah, be- oh, I've got to go all it. I, I will, I will. Because flex, if we do, oh. we would, bro. It's one of those things where, like, with the season that we've had, yeah, I know, I know. To, to to get out of it and champ, like, to scumbag it and have against still- Man City as well, because you oh. can't really fluke oh. against. Like, he called me yesterday, yeah, and I answered the phone. And went, like, you know, I always answer for Mister the Comedian, and he just started going, <laughs> "Owen, if we win it," and I went, "KG, KG," and he went, "No, no, no, if we win it," and I was like, "What, what?" He went, "If we win it." I'm going to be such a prick. <laughs> he was giving it that. He was giving it. He went, I'm going to awesome. call True Jordy. I went, I don't know why. <laughs> Everyone. He's not going to call Matisse. Yeah. I'm going to call Don Robbie. No, I'm going to call Because well, they're all expecting us to lose. Yeah. yeah. No, gonna, everyone, everyone has said, you lot, you delusional idiots, this, that, and the other. They've been cussing yeah. us, bro. Yeah. If, we, if we somehow, yeah, get out of this one, yeah, I'm telling you now, Fleck, yeah, the game... <laughs> The game, I saw the video of what Matisse did, how they defaced our studio, bro. They defaced it. That is a disgrace. I yeah. I was disgusted, yeah? And I said, you know what? Fine. I didn't even deal with it. I haven't really addressed it properly, yeah? I'm telling you now, if we win this one here. I'll go to his house. Oh, yeah, I'll go as well. I know where I'll it is. I'll go to his house. Exactly. You know where it is. So you <laughs> share the address with me. I'm, I'm due to go there in the summer as well to do the same thing yeah. you did, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. So we'll just run up in his yard and deface his yard. Face his house. Marabilia everywhere. Marabilia everywhere. I'm going to get KG to share a location with you because the FA Cup final last season is when Minna asked KG to share his location. Oh, yeah. And he just sent a picture of where he was at. I'm here. I'm here. Nah, this. KG, can I say something? You're a, a mad <laughs> uncle, bro. Uncle. No, KG. I know, no, KG. I know what she's asking uh, for. Uh, they want location. Uh. <laughs> I saw the SIM card. <laughs> Where is the landmark? There you I go, said, the landmark. Do you no, know I that's didn't... the most uncle fi- like, bro? <laughs> someone asked for your location. You took a picture and said here. I just I'm, said I'm, I'm here. I'm here. <laughs>